What's up, folks? Um, despite the fact that it's 80 degrees still, um, fall approaches us, which means uh, we gotta get ready for some Halloween themed stuff. And I got a package today from Witch Baby Soap, which is gonna be all of my uh, Halloween 2022 stuff from Witch Baby Soap. I kinda already opened it because I had to grab some gift stuff out of it for friends and whatnot. But, um, yeah, this is going to be everything I ordered that's going to be Witch Baby, Halloween, or Fall specific. Um, opening it up, first thing we've got is advertisement for Witch Baby Soap. Uh, that's cool. Uh, there's our order form. First thing I see is the Black Sunflower Bath Bomb. This was part of their new 2022 uh, fall collection. And looking at that, it says, It is sunshine on the inside and midnight on the outside. It's a nostalgic, dark, floral blend that smells like chunky autumn sweaters and fields of sunflowers. So it's got like a very um, earthy scent with the sunflowers, but... Like, the chunky autumn sweaters, it falls into Yankee candle scent territory. I like it. Uh, it's very neutral, I'll say that. Like, you can get sort of the earth tones, but then it's, uh, you know, it's kind of smooth with, like, the autumn sweaters. Like, a cotton kind of smell, a linen kind of smell, you know. Almost like laundry detergent, you know. But, I digress. I dig that one. I think that'll look cool. Um, we have a sticker from Witch Baby Soap. That's always cool. Um, let's see what we've got here next. Okay, so we got some body butter. Now, this is one of the scents that wasn't offered in a bath bomb, but they did it as a soap. I think a face scrub and a body butter. This is... Witchy Ants. Say that again. Witchy Ants Body Butter. This is supposed to be uh, a blend of Snapdragon Apples, Golden Pear, and Wild Thyme. So, it says it's cool and unusual as your favorite Witchy Ant. Oh my god, I love that. That fucking smells amazing. And, again, it's one of those things that I'm sad that... It only came in as, you know, not as a bath bomb, because I would have bought this totally if it was a bath bomb, because it's a great scent, but this has a really good, like, fall to early December kind of smell. Like, yeah, I definitely dig that a lot. Moving on. That out of the way. That's a gift item. Next we have this big honkin' bath bomb. This is Plumpkin. It's a purple pumpkin. They have not done a purple pumpkin before. They've done orange with hollow mass. They've done green, white, and I think like blue. I'm remembering that, but uh, Plumpkin is a purple pumpkin. And it's juicy, ripe plum and fairy tail pumpkin with echoes of cinnamon, sandalwood, and musk to create a magical blend to completely enchant your senses in this bewitching Halloween bath bomb. I gotta say, like, oh yeah, it's really musky. Like, you can smell the plum, but, like, the pumpkin, the cinnamon, the sandalwood, the musk, it's very earthy with a hint of fruit in there, so... That'll be an interesting one, yeah. Moving on. Oop, make sure that doesn't fall. We've got Celestial, which has the cool uh, Sun King kind of uh, icon on it. And Celestial is supposed to be, quote-unquote, Worship the heavens with this whimsical stargaze blend that smells of crushed velvet, overgrown autumn sage, birch trees climbing towards the stars, and a blanket of fallen leaves. Bathe in the universe as a biodegradable stars and gold shimmer burst out in this sapphire bath bomb. God, that 
makes my loins tingle just reading that. Um, not as musky uh, or, or like earth based as the other ones. Like this has almost like a clone kind of sense. You dig? Um, but it seems like the scents they've gone for have been less candy or pumpkin or like Halloween. -y. You know, it's been more like earth plant scents for this season. Yeah, that has a real earth, earthy kind of scent to it. Moving on. We have the Witchy Ant Soap. Now, I got this as both a body butter and soap. Because, I mean, just look at that. That is some cool fucking details. Um... Smells as great as the body butter. Again, I wish this had been a bath bomb. Maybe next year they'll do a throwback or something and make it into a bath bomb. I don't know. Um, I just get that Witch Baby Soap. Last year, they started doing um, four scents for the season, and they would do all four as a bath bomb, and they would do, like, three body butters, three as, uh, you know... Uh, body scrub, three as a soap, that sort of thing. Um, but this one, it seems like there's, they don't do all four as a bath bomb. Now, <clears throat> I know, like, if you go back to, like, 2016, 2017, they were doing, like, seven or eight cents a season. But they would do, like, four that were exclusively bath bombs. And, you know, three that were exclusively, um you know, body butter or soap or face mask or something like that. So, I don't know. I think they should do all four as a bath bomb and then, like, kind of, like, divvy it up, whether it be soap or face mask or body scrub or something. But, yeah, I digress. I think I have one more thing in here. Yeah. Or two more, actually. Um, this is another soap. This is the Auto Autumn Caffeomancy Soap. So, um, this is supposed to be pumpkin spice latte, if I'm not mistaken, but let me double check with that. Uh, bu, bu, bu. Yes. Um, uh, this autumn caffeomancy soap is mega exfoliating because it's got coffee grounds in it. It smells like a warm pumpkin spice latte. It has notes of pumpkin spice, maple syrup, pecans, whipped cream, and marshmallow. They must have for any pumpkin spice latte lover. And yeah, it smells exactly like that. I got this because um, I figure, okay, I can get Halloween stuff, but I'll get something that will be like good for November, like into Christmas, you know. So I'm happy I got that. I think I have one more thing in here, another soap. I got the Hollow Mass Soap, if you can see there. The detail, you got a bat and a pumpkin inside. That's just awesome. Um, and Hollow Mass is the seasonal scent that comes out every Halloween from Witch Baby Soap. They call it the uh, embodiment of October. The intoxicating aroma of crushed, caramelized jack-o'-lantern guts drenched in bourbon vanilla with a dash of warm pumpkin spice. So... You know, it's not too close to Caffeomancy. It has more of the pumpkin smell to it. But um, it's a classic scent, so I just had to get it. <laughs> but looking at this, I don't see anything else in my order. So yay! My haul is three soaps, three bath bombs, and a uh, body butter. So, three soaps. Three bath bombs. And body butter. So, yeah, nice haul. Um, just can't wait for Halloween countdown to begin. I'll be doing something for that, obviously. I got more stuff from other companies to order. And, uh, yeah, so this was my... Uh, Witch Baby Soap Halloween 2022 haul. So thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. And keep your eyes out for this coming Halloween.
Thanks.